It's another edition of Answer the Internet delivered by Postmates. I'm KFC, host of KFC Radio at Barstool Sports. For the last seven years, our podcast has been dealing with the weirdest, most difficult hypothetical questions the internet has to offer. Now we're putting celebrities and comedians to the test, asking them the same questions. We got Big Brown Brendan Shaw back here once again, his second appearance. The first time he came on, it was the first episode of Answer the Internet to really pop, put us on the map. So he's back once again. We're putting him to the test with harder and weirder questions this time. Anytime you need anything delivered anywhere, use Postmates. Download the app, use the promo code KFC for $100 off your delivery charge for the next seven days. What's up guys, I'm Brendan Schaub and I'm back. I am back, make sure you check out my special on Showtime, you'd be surprised. Watch it for free, go to Showtime.com, promo code Schaub, you get 30 days of free Showtime. Enjoy. Uh, come loudly every time you fart or fart loud every time you come. Dude. Uh, <laughs> here we go! Um, uh, definitely fart loud every time you come. Yeah. Yeah, just let it go, you know what I'm saying? Like, give him a heads up, I'm about to bust. <laughs> it's like a fucking foghorn. It'd be sick. I'm about to bust. Brrrr! <laughs> Uh, you got offered a billion dollars to never leave the state of Ohio. Do you take it? Nope. I'm doing all right. And I like to travel, so I'm good. A nah. Bill. Not that I don't not like Ohio, but for a billion, nah. Would you lose all your own memories or never be able to make your new ones? Ooh, I have a kid, so it's a different animal. Different animal. Uh, he's getting pretty awesome, so I'd lose all my old memories. But then you lose ones of him when he's like, one, two, and three years old. Yeah, but now, now the cool shit kicks in. When he's a baby, I'm just kind of like the side piece, make sure he stays alive. <laughs> now he's like, you know, he's older, he, he knows who I am. Now's the time. If you could have any two people fight in a no rules cage match, who would you choose? God, I don't hate anybody. I'm balls deep in Game of Thrones, so I'd like a real fight between the Hound and the Mountain. That'd be pretty dope to, for like an official win. Like a real shit, like death match. The That'd be sick. Right? Maybe you seen him lately? He had a stroke. Half his face is all fucked up. The hound looks pretty gnarly. How much money would it take for you to not know how to read? Uh, do we even need to read? I can barely read. I'm balling. So whatever. <laughs> what else we got? <laughs> for ten thousand dollars, would you carry around an anime body pillow that looks like a human for one month? Have to introduce it as your boyfriend and girlfriend? Nope. Balling. Again, yeah, 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 fall no, no. back to balling. We're gonna no, we'll change that number for you. Uh, how rich are you? Let's do uh, let's do one hundred thousand. Nope. Five, we'll do five hundred thousand. Nope. How fucking rich is Brandon Shaw? <laughs> a million. What the fuck? <laughs> All right, a million dollars for one month. No. A Get month. Out of no. You just have to carry a pillow for a month. Everywhere I go. So what? It's a million dollars. My kid is like, what's wrong with dad? Is dad a Shaw serial killer? A million dollars, you little idiot. Nah, I'm good. <laughs> You. Uh, you are in an open field armed with a baseball bat. How many 10 year olds, this is dark, how many 10 year olds wearing black helmets could you take down before they get you? Uh, man, uh, I mean, how many are running at me? I would say a few hundred, a few hundred getting concussed like a motherfucker, you know what I'm saying? Barry Bonds and these little 10 years old. I'd be all right. The first kid is just, he douche, and they're like, oh, Fuck, man. <laughs> yeah, and the rest of them are like, I guess. If you could have sex with any person you want at any time, but you can only watch women's, <laughs> you can only watch women's sports forever, would you do it? God, NBA's getting good right now. Sex with any person you want at any time. I'm taking the sex. Sports are overrated. I'm watching the store, the WNBA just balls deep into the fucking Seattle storm. Like, get it, girl. Get it. This is a nail biter. Would you rather go to jail for one year or go to jail with a Rubik's Cube and you can leave when it's done? Right, that Rubik's Cube seems pretty tough, but I've seen children compete it. We don't have a Rubik's Cube in here, right? I'll do the Rubik's Cube. Really? Yes. I, I feel like I'd get it done. Have you done it? Way, have you done it? No, hell no. You guys no, never I'm done idiot. it? I did one. One time I did the sticker thing and that's it. You don't think as grown men you could figure out in a year? I don't like the confidence in him. Absolutely. I don't like your opinions don't, don't like on Game of Thrones <laughs> and I don't like your confidence in Rubik's Cubes. You, I mean, like, you literally you just a minute ago said you barely know how to read. 
and now all of a sudden you're gonna stop rooms you? <laughs> Different game. Would you rather watch your dad have sex with a hundred year old man? Wow. Or watch your mom kill someone. It's getting dark, bros. I know it's my second time, but let's take it easy, you know? Um I guess watch my dad have sex with a hundred year old man. A no win, man, you know? I don't want someone to die. Ah, uh, man, that's dark. If you could pick one celebrity to have your back in a bar fight, who would you pick? Uh, one celebrity, uh, Frank Grillo. You know who that is? He's in the Purge stuff. He's oh, tough. Yeah. Frank Grillo is an actual legit uh, boxer. Frank Grillo or The Rock, right? He's big yeah. tough. Yeah, those are too easy, right? You're building your dick from scratch. You make it as big as you want, but for every inch you add, you lose two years off your life. How big do you make it? Ah, oh, dude, I'm cool with what I got. Seven's fine. <laughs> <laughs> Would you have sex with a girl with no arms? Yeah, if like, for sure. If like Cindy Crawford in her prime was like fucking surfing and the shark was like, yoink, yoink, I'm still hooking up with Cindy Crawford. I don't give a fuck. If you could only watch one category of porn for the rest of your life, what would it be? Big butts. I go for the big butts. It's, not, it's all sorts of race, mix. It's great in there. Yeah, bro. Easy. Brazers, what's up? Thanks, man.